So, um, the video I'm going to be talking about is not commonly, or it, it's basically more for guitar playing, but I have a bass, but this also refers to bass players because beginners on stringed instruments that can use pedals are like this. Okay, I'm going to be going over the common misconceptions about bass as a beginner. Conception one, and people that don't play this, uh, which we call it, have, have the same idea. Pick is easier. That's, that's false. Well, I guess it's easier when you're first starting out, but overall, walking and slapping It's not easier because you once you learn how to walk right uh, on your bass, walking is this. You could, it's way easier to walk faster than picking, so I would disagree. I wouldn't say one's harder than the other, but one is definitely more beginner friendly, which is pick. I use pick because it's just more comfortable for me. And anyways, I have smaller fingers, most, yeah. Misconception number two is, um, I guess this is kind of like a dumb thing to do. I guess not dumb because it kind of makes sense, but unless you know better, getting better gear makes you sound better. That's a misconception. It does not. Well, you know what I mean? It doesn't improve your playing, but it improves the sound. Um, yeah, I mean, it just improves the sound, but it does not improve your playing at all. Um, because you might get notes like, you could tell when they hit notes like, you know, those weird, those just, yeah, that sound, not good. Anyways, so another thing they do besides buying gear is you might know this, I have a distortion pedal, big muff distortion pedal. The thing about this puppy is... I haven't turned up really loud, uh, but anyways, um, so my phone can get the frequency, that's why I have it up so loud, because when it's quiet, it can't pick up the frequencies. Anyways, um, and no, you, you could tell if you play, I mean, even if you don't play an instrument, you could tell when someone's a beginner, it just doesn't sound right. Um, and so, that does not mean if you use a pedal, you're a beginner. That's not what it means. Some of the best guitar and bass players use pedals. I mean, probably the best bass players and guitar players use pedals. Um, because if they're trying to get a certain sound, that doesn't cut it just without a pedal. So, like I say, using a pedal does not mean you're a beginner. But, if you don't know how to play bass or guitar, don't buy a bunch of pedals and new gear. Learn how to play the instrument first. New gear will not make you better at playing guitar or bass. Um, misconception number three is actually between bass and guitar. Four strings on a bass, and the bass players usually go slower than the guitar players. So. Guitar is harder. No. That's, that's just bullshit. Um, if anybody tells you that, they're kind of a dumbass because, especially with the speed part, like, um, it's opinionated if bass or guitar is harder. Um, I think they're both equally as hard. But the thing about guitar, why you can go faster, is because these strings are so much thicker than guitar strings. This neck is is way bigger than a is bigger than a guitar neck and that's because the strings are thicker my thinnest string is about as is like one and a half times as big as a as a guitar's thickest string so when it's thicker it's harder to move so you can't move as fast that's why guitar is so easy to go fast on so bass is extremely hard to go really fast on and uh, I just practice all my stuff at you know going fast that's why I could play fast
But um, misconception, another misconception between guitar and bass is that, you know, it's just guitar is more fun, um, you know, because there's more to do with it. Um, bass doesn't have chords, guitar has chords, so of course there's going to be more chords for guitar. But no, um, the necks are longer, so there's more frets to play. Um, I'm not, no way am I saying which one's more fun for me, because I'm a bass player, bass is more fun. But um, there's multiple ways to play bass. You could, you could strum, you could pick with your pick. You could walk. slap and then you could you know hit with your fingers like and then there's this weird picking thing where you basically and uh, and then there's hybrid picking which is also on guitar but and then go like this with your middle finger or these fingers to walk. That's also on guitar, but in guitar, well with guitars for picking methods, you don't hit or you don't walk or slap. You can slap, but it doesn't sound as good. Um, and yeah, most guitar players do pick. Um, there is hybrid picking, which is on guitars, is where you finger pick. You can finger pick on guitar. Um, and yeah, another misconception between guitars, well it's not a misconception, I just find it funny, that bass players who walk are automatically better. Um, no, I would disagree with that heavily. Um, well, I wouldn't heavily disagree with that. I'd say, it's, yeah, I don't know. I'd just say it doesn't matter if you, what it takes, I don't think either of them take, I think they have equal amount of skill um, but no, and then guitar players, they say that, and then they pick and don't, hardly any of them finger pick. They just pick with a pick. So I just find that kind of hypocritical. But anyways, um, that is my misconceptions and misunderstandings about bass and some guitar. I hope you guys do enjoy. Smash that like. I'm just kidding. Do not. I don't give a shit if you smash the like button or not. Whatever the fuck you want to do. You fucking raped that like button. I wouldn't give two shits. But thank you.